the Cotton Bowl at Dallas is crammed with a capacity-plus crowd for the annual battle between the Longhorns of Texas and the Oklahoma Sooners. This is one of the hottest rivalries in the Southwest, dating back to 1900, with the Longhorns on the losing end of the last three meetings. Oklahoma is guarding the longest winning streak in collegiate football, 21 games. But Texas head coach Ed Price has his steers raring to go as Oklahoma takes the field. After receiving the opening kickoff, Texas tries to travel on the arm of Joe Clements. But Jerry Tubbs intercepts for Oklahoma on the Longhorn 33. Tommy McDonald drives up the middle to pick up six yards. Jimmy Harris comes back and hands off to Tommy McDonald. Tommy tears around right in and loops through the Longhorns on a 28-yard touchdown trip that puts Oklahoma out in front of Texas, six to nothing. Jimmy Harris will attempt the extra point. The pass from center is high and the kick is blocked. Oklahoma still leading six nothing. In the second period, the Texans come back on the passing attack sparked by Joe Clements. He hits Joe Youngblood on the Longhorn 28. Clements cranks up and fires again. Menon Shriver is on the other end for a seven-yard game. The Steers stampede into Sooner territory as Clement clicks with Shriver to put the ball in the 49. Dell Womack waffles the center of the Oklahoma line for five yards. Fourth down finds the Longhorns a yard short. Clement sneaks but fails to make it and Oklahoma takes over. The Sooners send Cecil Morris crashing through the Steers to the Texas 25. Quarterback Jay O'Neill keeps the ball as he goes through the line, then pitches back to Cecil Morris, who gets to the Longhorn 14. Price sweats this one out as the Steers dig in with fourth down coming up. Bob Burris passes, but it's broken up, and Texas takes over on its own 16. The Longhorns' Charlie Brewer gambles on a pass deep in his own territory and loses as Tommy McDonald intercepts to bring the ball to the Texas 7. The Sooners make it all the way this time. Tommy McDonald sprints for home and makes it standing up as Oklahoma ups its advantage over the University of Texas, 13-0 at the end of the first half. The Longhorn Herd hits the trail again in the third period. Clemens gets things moving with a perfect peg to Shriver on the Texas 36. Del Womack gets the ball and comes around left end. He runs into a crowd of Sooners and takes them with him for eight yards. Quarterback Clemens has found a flaw in the Sooner defense, and he takes advantage with another bullet pass to Menon Shriver to the Oklahoma 46. Clements tries to keep Texas moving through the air, but Doyle Jennings breaks through to smother him for a 15-yard loss on his own 39. Second down with 25 to go, Texas crosses up the Sooners as Del Womack works the delayed buck. He laterals to Walt Fondren, who rips and twists his way for 32 yards. The Longhorns have their deepest penetration, but the Oklahoma defense is airtight. Joe Clements hurls a fourth down pass. It's broken up and Texas must give up the ball. The Sooners move immediately into Texas territory. Jim Harris keeps them moving as he hangs onto the ball and crashes to the 37. Tommy McDonald takes a pitch out and then lobs a pass to John Bell as the Oklahomans move to the Longhorn 29. Jim Harris keeps the ball and scrambles through the left side. He pitches back to Billy Pricer, and Billy barrels for 21 yards to make it goal to goal for the Sooners. Bob Burris dives over for the score as Oklahoma extends its winning streak to 22 by defeating the Texas Longhorns for the fourth straight time. The final score, 20 to nothing, marks the first time since 1938 that Oklahoma has been able to shut out Texas in this traditional game.